Hello, my name is Martin Creasy. I'm the Customer Services Manager at Iron Science and welcome to our web portal and we're going to run through a series of training videos to help you, our customer, in the support and maintenance of your instruments. Position the mini-pid so that the electrode stack is face up. Then, using the removal tool, Align the arms of the removal tool so that they fit within the two slots on the mini-pid body. Place a finger lightly above the electrode stack to prevent it becoming lost when the clip is released and squeeze together the removal tool. The electrode stack should now spring free. You should now be able to easily remove the electrode stack and separate the mini-pid into its three components. The electrode stack, for the lamp and mini pid body. Within the mini pid body, there is also a spring that will occasionally come loose. When replacing the electrode stack, it is useful to inspect the metallic stacks for sign of corrosion or damage. This will help to determine the frequency of maintenance required in each particular application. Remember, the electrode stack is a consumable part. When handling the lamp, hold the lamp by the glass body. It is important to avoid placing fingers on the window of the lamp to prevent the window from being contaminated by finger grease. Dip a clean cotton bud into the aluminum oxide cleaning powder and lightly tap off any excess. Press the tip of the powdered cotton bud firmly onto the window of the lamp and rotate in circular movements. Once you can hear a light squeaking sound, this is an indication that the lamp window is clean. Any excess powder on the lamp window can be removed, either using a lint-free cloth or by blowing clean, dry and oil-free air across the lamp. The best method of fitting the electrode stack to ensure a good seal between lamp and stack is to firstly place the electrode stack on a flat surface with the metallic stacks face up. Next, supporting the stack in place, hold the lamp by the glass body and gently twist and push the lamp into the electrode stack. Then, position the mini-pid so that the space in which the lamp sits is aligned directly above the electrode stack and lamp in the correct orientation. Push directly downwards until you hear two faint clicks. The mini pid is now assembled and ready for use. After cleaning the lamp, calibration will be required. We would recommend running the assembled instrument for approximately 30 minutes prior to carrying out calibration post lamp maintenance. For further information, please visit ironscience.com. Thank you.